I'm Sonia Vasquez. I work for Ripley Entertainment making wax figures. Well, the first thing we'll do is collect photographs of the person that we're making a figure of and we'll get photographs every angle of the head and then I'll sit down with that and start a clay sculpture and then we get started on the body and for that we will live cast a model that's to the same proportions as the person that we're making the figure of and then the model will match that to the body. So the bodies are not typically sculpted, they are live cast off of people. This head's not, uh, this is not a finished sculpt yet. Um, we're gonna have to age him several years, get him where he needs to be. But this will be the Bill Clinton head. This is what the head mold looks like. It's a two-part urethane rubber mold. At this point, we'll, I would put the mold together and then I would take it over to the wax pot and for a wax head. I came to the wax museum here, the one that I work at when I was a kid on a field trip, and I thought it was really cool. I remember going home telling my mom that when I grew up I want to make wax figures. It seemed like the neatest job in the world. So I did go to college, I went to UNT, studied sculpture there, but I was the only person doing portrait sculpting, so it's mostly self-taught. This is a Lance Armstrong figure. So this is, once we pull the wax head out of the mold, then the whole thing, um, first thing we do is set the eyes and the teeth. The eyes are prosthetic grade eyes, handmade. And the teeth, I buy them at a dental supply, same place the dentist goes to get teeth to make dentures. And then the hair will get plugged after that. And it is plugged one hair at a time throughout the entire thing. It takes about three, four weeks to do a full head of hair. And then the whole thing is hand painted. I'm Sonia Vasquez. I work for Ripley Entertainment. I am a wax goddess.